What's going on, moviegoers? If you're new to the channel, my name is Christian, and welcome to SeaWorld Productions. You guys, we have a huge trailer dropping tomorrow. Terminator Dark Fate. Now, I'll be honest with you. I haven't liked the Terminator movie since Judgment Day. And what, that was like in 1991? So it's been a long time since I've actually liked a good Terminator movie. Now, the first two Terminator movies were absolutely fantastic. Fantastic films. I go back and rewatch them all the time and they just get better. They're like wine. They get better with time, especially, especially the second one. Judgment Day is literally probably one of the greatest sequels of all time. And sequels are always hard to pull off. But after that, the franchise just took a huge drop off and everything just fell fucking flat. Not good whatsoever. But I'm happy to hear that they went the Halloween route. This film is a direct sequel to Judgment Day. So everything after you know, Judgment Day that came out is no longer canon. It no longer exists. So they're treating this like a trilogy. It's going to be directed by Tim Miller. Um, Arnold Schwarzenegger's coming back. Um, gosh, Sarah Connor, forgot her name. Something Hamilton's coming back as well. She was in the first two films. That's the only film she did. Um, and I believe James Cameron even wrote his story for this movie. And Tim Miller is a fantastic job. I loved what he did with, you know, the first Deadpool movie. And I was kind of bummed out he didn't return, you know, for the second one. But I'm, I'm pretty stoked to see where they take the storyline for this next Terminator movie, you guys. I'm, I'm so curious to see what's going to happen. Literally, a d direct sequel after Judgment Day. I love it. I think it's a great idea. And I love the fact that, you know, these movie franchises are recognizing that, you know, Hollywood put out a bunch of terrible fucking sequels. And they're just ignoring all those and going literally right after, you know, the second one. I love the fact that they did that. You know, they did that with Halloween. Not saying, you know, all the Halloween movies were shit. Um, they're guilty pleasures, obviously, to me. Um, I just, I think that's just a great, unique, and fun way to kind of bring back the franchise. You get what I'm saying? Because like I said, Terminator has been dead since Judgment Day. Um, and I'm pretty sure we can all agree to that. Because even the one with Christian Bale, it's just, they just, just didn't do it. But the trailer does drop tomorrow. Tomorrow morning. Um, so expect my reaction for the trailer. I will not have my reaction up probably until maybe 3.34 ish because I have work in the morning. Obviously, I'm going to miss it, but I'm going to stay offline because I don't want to see any spoilers for this trailer. I want to go in open minded and I cannot wait to see what they throw in there. It's going to be a lot of fun. And I like to see Arnold back. I've always been you know, a big fan of Arnold. I want to see what his role is going to be in this movie. It's going to be pretty interesting. I don't know if John Connor is going to be in this movie. Most likely not. Because I feel like the, the, the story has always been evolved around John Connor over the last three movies. <laughs> it's just time to take a step back from that character and go back to, you know, Sarah Connor, who started it all originally, right? But I'm pumped, you guys. Post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about Terminator, Dark Fate. What are your expectations? Do you think this film is going to put this franchise in the right path? Post your comments down below, you guys. And thank you for taking time today for watching SeaWorld Productions. Peace.